Hi guys, welcome to Shaq's World, my name is Shaq. Today I'll be doing a new modification to my 2017 Suzuki GSX-R 1000. But before I start, please smash the subscribe button and hit the notification bell for upcoming videos. So I just bought a brand new windscreen of AliExpress. This only cost me $30, it's very good value for your money. However, it took one month and a half just for this to arrive. So I'll show you guys the list of tools you need to change a windscreen on a 2017 Suzuki GSX-R. So, I've got a star head screwdriver, as you guys can see. A Allen key. Don't ask me about the size, I don't know. Um, a flat head screwdriver, as you guys can see. And a 10 mil spanner. But, so, let's get started, guys. That's the stock windscreen. It doesn't look too bad, however, I don't like the factory windscreen. I prefer the smoked one instead. In my opinion, it looks a lot nicer. Step one, get your star screwdriver and take the six screws off. Step two, you get your flathead screwdriver and take these caps off. There's two on each side. So what you do is you put it inside, bang, one of them is off. And the next one's off. Next step is you get your 10 mil spanner and your Allen key. You put the Allen key in the front of the mirror and you put the spanner behind the mirror so the 10 mil bolt doesn't move. Very easy. Both of the mirrors are off now. It will make it a lot easier to take the windscreen off. All you have to do is pull it out gently so you don't scratch the fairings or damage it. When you take the windscreen off, the next step is you gotta take these grommets off. The rubber grommets. And you gotta put this on the new windscreen, as you guys can see. When you put the old grommet from the old windscreen to the new windscreen, as you guys can see, all you have to do is you gotta slide the windscreen inside the fairing. However, you gotta do it very gently so you don't scratch or damage the fairings. When you line up the windscreen nicely, all you have to do is put these star screws back on. You just hand tighten them just in case if you want line wrapping. Next step is to put the mirrors back on. However, when you're putting the mirrors back on, you just hand tighten them. The last step is to make sure everything is lined up nicely. And then after that, what you do is you tighten the mirrors and the windscreen. Guys, please smash the subscribe button and hit the notification bell for upcoming videos. Thank you. 